So tonight, we are heading to our favorite restaurant. It's called Boca Taqueria, but it wasn't always called Boca Taqueria. It used to be called Roses. I actually know the guy who started it all. We go to church together. He went on a mission to, I think it was Mexico, and he learned how to cook this really authentic Mexican food. If you ask my wife, any other Mexican food restaurant, no matter how authentic it really is, it's not authentic because it's not roses. Well, roses isn't roses anymore either because he sold roses and the people who bought it cheapened it down, blanded it out, and it's just, it's not very good. But then he started Tia Roses. And that ran for a while, and that was great. It had a nice restaurant, a little taco shop that was in the same parking lot as the restaurant. It was really a nice restaurant. I mean, it almost seemed like a high-end restaurant, even though the prices were pretty reasonable. And the taco shop was at very reasonable prices. They had a kitchen fire, and I guess there was some issues with the landlord and the regulations with the city or something like that, and he just he gave up on it. But another guy comes in that he had sold the roses to originally. They come in and they take over. They, again, they dumb it down. They land it out. They just cheapen it up. You know, it's just not, it's not tea roses anymore. He had this other restaurant across town that was still open, but I understand that he didn't actually run that one. It was his son or someone like that ran it. Um, there were some rumors about a divorce or something and it being shut down and that was into that one So now we're like, okay, now what? Where's our favorite restaurant? Well, they opened up another taco shop and That's where we're going tonight, but his son-in-law that actually runs it decided to rename it And I can understand that because the roses that's still out there that's still running Is not the same. It just is not anywhere as good as the Tia Roses, as the taco shop, as the taqueria, as they like to call it. And so he changed the name. He changed it to Boca Taqueria. And so that's where I'm headed now. And I'm late because I was on call at work. Had an issue I had to deal with. So I'm running behind. They're already there. I'm another 20 minutes away. It's I'm going to get there when they're done eating. It's going to suck for me. But still heading that way, so... We'll see you there. So there's my wife's forerunner, which is, you know, pretty cool. And then over here, this is totally awesome forerunner. Wow. So over there is the brown and greenfield intersection. And then over here we have the Boca Taqueria, where it looks pretty full. Hey, look. Look who's right here. What's up, Jeff? How are you? Good, how are you? Good, I get some meat. Yeah. And that's Justin. Hello. Hi. What's up? She's going camping with me again is with a camping trailer. Oh. I'm not gonna be. You have to. 